Hello everyone, welcome to the Cup of Joe show. It's Monday, so happy Monday. If you missed it, I put a, a new Moody Mam comic over on my Twitter. My Twitter handle is just Hey Cock Joe. <laughs> I'm sorry, let me... Today, we're going to be running the Dukemon version of the Pendulum version 20th, and I've already got plans. I've got such plans on exactly what I want to run. We're going to Jogress into some Digimon that I'm quite certain we've never gotten before. So here it is. In case you missed it before, this is the Duke. Are you seriously got Smudgy still on you? Welcome to the Dukemon version 20th of the Pendulum. Uh, this little guy is going to get a fresh new battery and it's also going to be installed with a fresh new set of screwdrivers since i can't seem to find my old nice multi one maybe i should start maybe you know trying to fix pempy now the penguin virtual pet that seemed all jacked up this one looks about right that looks about right it looks like it's maximum not going to strip the screw you know wowie 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 that sure did feel smooth all right here you go have a battery Dang, it wasn't even in yet. You're a bit gung-ho, aren't you? So let's do a big fat load. Obviously. <laughs> a big fat load. <laughs> Sorry. <gasps> oh no. Oh no, Slayer Dramon. Oh no, what are you doing here? Oh no! What? Chaos Mon! Oh. You guys were supposed to be dead so that way I could hatch eggs today. What do you want me to do? Reset? But I want to use all the copymons. I'm sorry, everyone. I didn't plan for this, honestly. <laughs> oh, no. You guys are going to have to make them die. Oh, God. I'm sorry. Just a recap to anyone who's curious about what's happening right now. Um, I'm feeding them pills to the point that they reach 99 weight, which makes them sick. Or I guess specifically, it makes them depressed. And then I'm curing it, and then I'm training them once to bring their weight de back down from max, so that way they can have another uh, vitamin, which will bring their weight back up to 99. And so once they become depressed enough enough times, they're just gonna die. Is this cruel? Yes, it is. Uh, do I feel bad? Yes, I do. Do I have any other option right now? Because the show must go on after all. I don't think so. Oh, there it is. There it- it's happening. I know like when I die, I'm gonna make a big hammy deal about it too, but- and then I'll- I'm gonna turn into a computer, of course, but- and then there they go. I'm so sorry, Slayer Jermon. I'm so sorry, Chaos Mon. You guys were super cool. God, okay, I can clear my head now. Let's just- okay, let's all take a step back. I'm gonna- I'm gonna step back over here for- let's all take a deep breath, okay? With me now, everyone. <gasps> oh wait, that's bad. You're supposed to do it through your nose. Okay, okay, hold on. Here we go. <sighs> okay. So now for real, <laughs> welcome to the group hatch, the Jogress one. It's where our goal is to just Jogress a bunch, and so that's what we're going to do today. My plans are to run a Wind Guardian's egg and a Deep Saver's egg, and we're going to get them to Jogress up the ranks into something that I'm quite certain we've never gotten before. So let's just start with egg numero uno. Uh, yes. Wait, do I, can I not? Wait, what about the other egg? No, oh, right, shake the egg! Oh, God! You're right, I forgot, thank you! Oh, God dang it, I just realized that the Digimon I'm, I'm planning to end up with are totally a flying and a swimming Digimon, too. This- <laughs> This is me. This is me, welcome- Welcome to uh, Chilling with Kakujo. Or this is what I do. I do last week's work. Today. Okay, I sure hope that was a hundred shakes. Man, I got so used to playing the VPET version 20th that I have just- I forgot about the whole... Yeah, the old totally... Maybe not even evolve. This is crazy to me. All right, Pichimon. I don't know how many shakes you want. Usually the babies want eight. Is that good? I never did really like commit to memory what was a good shake. Yeah, look at that three. Ah! All right, next egg. Ah, right, here we go. Wind Guardians. Let's go with a shaky shake. <laughs> Welcome to shaking babies with Kakujo. But seriously, don't do that. It's bad for babies. Yeah, that's the whole title of the show. The subtitle is the parentheses part, of course. Cause you know. We got a brand to push here. I mean, it's good shakes. Okay, this is like when you go to the Child Garden in Sonic Adventure and you pick up the egg, and Sonic's all like, like this. It's like it's like that kind of thing, except for virtual pets. You got you got to give them a stiff shake because they're inside of a box. That sounds worse, actually. Just forget I said that. Yeah, there you go. Welcome to life, child. Other child. Oh, <gasps> you've got a little Copymon, don't you? Wait, do you have a Copymon? Peachymon, where's your Copymon? Wait a mo. 
Gnocchimon. Oh, Gnocchimon. It makes me think of those little potato pastas. You know, the ones called gnocchis. All right, so why don't I go ahead and like lay down the path for you guys. Um, the I didn't mean to make what we're ending up with basically be what we should have ended up with on the last hatch. It just kind of happened that way only because I was looking down the list of the Digimon that we have achieved in these devices and I, I wanted to jogress into something uh, fresh. I didn't want to. I didn't necessarily want to jogress into anything that was super hard to get because we've already done that quite a lot. I mean, you can even see in our catalog here, and also you saw me earlier murdering them. But uh, we could go for some of the super difficult to get, more anthro like human looking ones. The the big dudes with the suits like this guy or that one or uh, where where is it or that one. Or that one. The Wind Guardian will have one mistake to get the rookie Floramon, one maximum mistake and max half effort to get champion Kiwimon, and then from there, I'll just kind of let you see how that unfolds. For the most part, they're just going to be plants, and that's that's cool, but they're going to end up with something due to Jogressing that's not quite plant-like. Meanwhile, over on Peachimon's side, one mistake to get the rookie Ganimon, Two mistakes and half effort to get Ebidramon, and then from there, we'll keep going. And the, the entire time, their evolution line is going to pretty much stay water. It's not really going to change at all. We need to get little Peachimon, their own little Copymon. Hey, can I get you a Copymon? Is that something I could do for you? Gonna have to use the Swedish wood carving. Oh. You could use a code. No, you... Oh yeah, that's that's far less complicated. Okay, we'll use a Copymon code then. There's Dinosmon, Harrismon, Bulukomon. Wait, Bulukamon? Isn't that the newish one? Yeah, Bulukamon is the is the Chinese one. <gasps> Wait, we, guys, we should do the we should do Bulukamon. The password for Bulukamon is a zero is six one one three one. Okay. Wow, that's actually the dude. Show me your copy, mon. Let me look at him. Bulukamon. That's so neat. Look at him pick out. That's amazing. If there's anything that Digimon does that I dislike, it's that they put out their unreal expectations for how much meat one's going to eat in their life. Here's what I'm doing, you guys. I'm trying to like slowly work myself back up to uh, doing drawings again, but I kind of got demotivated with it all for a while there. So yeah, let's. Why don't we just start with drawing our little Mons as they evolve? You know, it's, if you think about it, it's the perfect warm up. We'll start small, and then eventually we'll get to the point where our Digimon are super detailed, and I'll have to do- huh? Oh! Look at you! Evolving right now here in front of us. Oh, is that Pokemon? It is Pokemon, or I guess it's Pokemon. This is just like with Peomon. They took away the poo and the pee sound in the English version. And I guess I just now illustrated why, because <laughs> I said poo and pee. Oh, now it's Yokimon's turn. <laughs> hey, Fafu's welcome. Fafu says this guy always look overdeveloped for a baby. Oh, you mean Pokemon? Yeah, no, I agree. They, they actually are like one of the most rookie looking uh, in training two slash baby two Digimon. Welcome everyone. To Pokemon, new page, new day, new life. Uh, apparently, a new zero one is in the works as well. It's been so long since I've used a pen. I guess this is going to be really great practice. I mean, now that you know, we're in the land of October, and you know what happens in October? Inktober, which usually I usually participate, and I don't know how I'm going to participate this year though. I might literally just do every Inktober day theme with Moody Mam Mam. Because, like, I genuinely do like drawing Moody Man Man lately. A cute little face. I'm gonna have to be careful. I'm gonna have to be very careful because this round part of their body is on the curve of my page. And you know how easily I can get screwed up with that. All right, no. No, that was that was executed uh, satisfactorily. There's some grass. There's some more grass. My goodness. Can I, can I top this? Oh, God, there's more grass. Every once in a while, a very long, satisfying eraser snake comes into my life. And I... <sighs> Thank the art gods for the opportunity. Uh, with Gnokimon, we're just going to completely blacken in uh, the center area. The outside is going to stay white. So since we want this mouth line to still be visible once it's complete, we're going to... Uh, I guess we're going to kind of frame this mouth line for the white line that it's going to become. There we go. It looks like he's got a little beard. Hmm, what else do Digimon do? 
They like to eat giant meats, so I'm just gonna draw like a big old meat over here. I'm gonna kind of have the the grass kind of pushed off to the side for it. Oh, how's our dude doing? Most of these are here decorative for us today, but what about what about you, chum? But remember, we need one care mistake. I think I'm going to go ahead and just let them do a training, like a lack of training care mistake. I want to make sure I don't accidentally do two care mistakes. All right, thanks for hanging out with me so far, guys. I'm gonna set up the stream for a Zelda Link's Awakening. Looks like someone stole my Switch. I don't know where someone took it. I, I'm going to have to go hunt for the switch. So yeah, I'll be back in a few minutes.